Okay, so yes, welcome back to Kingdoms of Amalur. This is part nine. You probably remember part eight as well. It was only a few hours ago. So yes, let's head on into the Caverns of Ingress here in Deterth. Find the waterfall. Okay. Well, good news, I have found the waterfall. Bump. Skadoosh. And then you. There we go. Yeah, I don't like this one. There we go, though. We got it. Hmm. Wipe this. Wipe these ones out. Ow. That honestly done so much damage. <laughs> Ow. Again. Really, mate? Really? There we go. That's you out. Okay. That's why then. I saw that you survived, so boom. Nice. Oh. Wait, that said Master Scepter, didn't it? What's it like then? That's terrible. Okay, good to know. Good to know. Okay, now let's move on. To the tree. I'm glad that this here actually just tells you what order to do it in, instead of me having to actually remember. So I'll be honest with you, I don't remember in the slightest. Ow. Ah, oh, you get. Activate in the anti-magic barrier. Ow. Jesus. Where it feels like every mage in the game, except myself, has an anti-magic barrier. And I don't know how I feel about that. Don't know. It's just like, ugh. I just head on through. And yeah, I guess we'll just do this. Retrieve the pedal. Pretty sure it said that we'll have to fight a boss or something. Oh well. What do these things even do to me anyway? Minus 50% damage? Ugh. Wow. So they literally weaken you to half your strength. Lovely. You know what that means then? Boom. Drop kick. I'm stuck on the floor again, aren't I? Nice, we got out of the floor. There we go. That wasn't too bad, now was it? 
Unlike Sherb, we'll have plenty of fate potions, so, oh yes. I should also see if any of these boggarts here. Nope, not a single one of them has any fate. Lovely. Eh, uh, okay. Also, did that get rid of my F? Yes, it did. Lovely. I gotta dig it. I gotta dig it. As I run along here, just don't forget to follow if at any point you do enjoy, guys. But, yeah. Also, it's weird that it keeps being like, oh, hey, you can unlock this door. It's like, mate, it's already open. Like, you don't need to tell me that I can unlock it. I like how I talked about scavs, even though technically I haven't even got to them yet. But it's okay. Head to the circle thing. A champion, Engard. Well done. I can use the petal to create an elixir for the Almain. He needs only to drink this. If it indeed frees him from the curse, he may leave. And I will finally have hope of saving Ulcerund from the Nath. Administer the potion to the out. Farewell, mortal. You've returned. Will the Fae allow me to leave? After you drank this. <laughs> Let me go if this works. Fine. I'll drink anything at this point. I, I can feel the curse leaving me. I, I'm not just saying that so I can leave. It, it, it's like a fever's breaking. I should get back to my wife. Thank you again, and farewell. Okay. <laughs> that was impressive. Our success with the Almain bears great portent for Alcerin. If a mortal can be cured, maybe a fey can as well. I believe that you could survive a journey through the Fellfire Pit. Will you help us with another task? I guess so. We wish to repeat our success with the Almain at a much grander scale. To do this, we require the essence of another plant, this time from the Fellfire Pit. The pit is located at the base of the great spine of Alcelon. The flower, the Fellfire Bloom, rests there. The only plant that grows in the pit. We know the mortal fondness for compensation and will reward. Excellent! Exercise caution in Alcelon, traveler. I'll try. We've already been near the Fellfire Pit, so we can just fast travel there. Ah, let's head on in, I guess. Guess and this is the way back out. Yep, it is. Cool. That's all good then. Find the Guardian. Okay. There we go. That's that thing dead. And there goes the wee mini one. Always just make sure you're taking out the champion sprites first. Because they'll be your biggest bother, so they will. Oh, cool. Take that. Ah, yep, fucker. Well, there, be good. Yep, that's it.
Cover just. Just throw all of those straight in the junk because I know I won't need them. There we go. Both of those are trash, so just throw both of them in the junk. Ooh, death touch. What does that do? Nice. Imagine you could fail that because your thing wasn't high enough. Oh yeah, I can dispatch you. Thanks, dude. There we go. Just move on from that then. <laughs> there we go. I'm fine at this game. I show off a wide variety of moves. I'm not just all about Meteor. But you know, it is good. Garbage. <laughs> when I say garbage, I mean for the build that I have went with. For someone else's build, these could be, like, the best weapons. Ah, crud. Didn't mean to have the fairy gourd out there, but pfft, accidental summon. So, just left them out. Also, was it just me, or was this one a lot easier to get? <laughs> like, run in here, defeat an Ascari, and leave? Sure. My thanks, child. We will, however, require your. Will you aid us again? I guess so. An audience with the keepers of the crossing, and then administer the sample with luck. You will free this entire region from the Naka affliction. Very at the bottom of Keralatha. Go only if you defend. Delve in. If our theory is correct. I need to go somewhere and do something. So yeah.
At least it is on the way, which is fine. You know, at least it's like there. And like, I need to get to there anyhow, so. You know, it's not completely out of the way. Did he seriously do a mana drain attack on my? What a cunt. Dude, you suck so hard. Like on a warrior or whatnot, that wouldn't even be an issue. On my current build, that's detrimental. Oh well. At least we got rid of them. Right, let's grab this lower stone up here. The withering war swept across the land. Seelie and Unseelie fought each other. The house of Valor was abandoned for the battlefields of Isa and Own. Engard battled hordes as the warriors of Valor thrived on the plains of Arathal. The storm grew as they joined the war, and the Seelie threw back the invaders. Here we go. There we are. Oh yeah, that's right. I kind of forgot that I was full. Oh well. No big deal. I go run up here, round here, grab the lower stone, probably challenge Pura, and yeah. That's the plan anyway. I'm actually running over here this way I can fast travel to this place. Wrong thing. Like, I don't mean to keep summoning him, it just happens. Here, what you got, my? Nothing good. There is stuff down there, but this lower stone's what we're after. The Seelie returned to the land, and the House of Valor was forever changed. The conflict of the cycle waned, and the Fae now embodied the peace of sleep. Engard no longer fought, and was without purpose. The great cycle turned through the ages. Seasons passed. A mortal defeated the champion of valor. His name was Haroth Magnus. 
Okay. Weird that it just was very bad with the subtitles there, but whatever. Grab that. Let's go. Grab you. I'll also check. Do you have... Oh, nice. You're just money. Hi there. Are you Pyrrha? Yes, you are. A child of dust? What brings you to the crown of the sun? The desert is unkind to mortals. Hi, you know, not too much. The Florian of the Circle sent you to access the crossing? It is highly unusual for a mortal to invoke a fey right. But your aura is most unlike a mortal's. Very well. Prepare yourself. Oh dear goodness. Love, what even is this nonsense? Huh? Well done. You are a skilled combatant. It's no wonder you've earned the respect of Florian in the circle. The Amulet of the Sun is yours, and with it your right to descend to the crossing. Ah, uh, thanks. What? Okay, well, we're grabbing that. Nice. What does this Amulet of the Sun thing do, anyway? Oh, it's not even something I can actually equip in here. Okay. Must just be like a key item then. Really? Over there? Ah, so I need to go to like there, then run across. Okay. I'll also hail while we're running here. And get us over here. There's a stone of spring here. Nice. Unknown to Tyrion's tired pilgrims lumbered in the plains. Laboured grunts trumpeted the call of brutish Jotun, the giant kin of old. The hammer wielders, in grievous march, they trampled wood and tumbled stone. The fleshy weight of steps crushed the bones of warriors past. Kellerin's legion spread too thin. Bayala's prayers went unanswered, and the fear of death came too easily with the heavy step of the hill dwellers. Fair. Oh, I guess turn up. More you do, really. Whatever. Oh yes, that's something else I also wanted to check. How many places have we actually discovered? 86, nice. Just because there's another trophy involved for whenever you get 100 places discovered. So that's why I was curious. Terrible, but the extra XP was nice. That's nothing else.
I know where it says I should go, but at the same time, there's a chest up here. Well, I looked. Wasn't anything good. Nothing good at all. I'll grab the shaft, because that'll allow me to make a really strong staff in the future. Welcome to Keralatha, mortal. We have not had visitors in a very long time to deal with the Narca course. If Pura has given you the means to pass, you should seek out Halcyor. He will assist you in this. We keepers routinely delve into the depths of Keralatha to make minute adjustments to the crossing, ensuring its path find the crossing, and Halcyor will un Take caution in these lands, mortal. Your kind is particularly susceptible to its By particularly acceptable, susceptible, he means you lot can die. up. There we go. Oh, Jesus. Hailed. Let's get going. What's my watch wanting? Ah, okay. Just an email. Not that important. Behind, I would actually like to get around to this objectives so I can continue to tell their stories. Was not expecting a prismere tool, not gonna lie. It's a good for you fight though. Uh, ow.
None of that stuff, please. There we go. I won't bother with all of this, I don't think, but I'll have a look. Oh, there's a dispel chest, that'll be good. At the very least, it's some extra XP if I dispel it. Hmm. Robe of Seasons. Nice. What was that other thing? Damn it. <laughs> hmm. Wait, that's another dispel chest, so let's go grab that. That wee stupid thing out of the way. What's down here now? Nothing good, so we'll move on. Why are you out of the way? Eh. It's all a bit terrible. I'll take the money. No, don't care for that. And what's this? Don't care for that either. Like we've got a ring that does plus twenty percent damage. Okay, this one's hard apparently, so Easy. And you know, for like a decent amount of extra XP, there's no reason not to have got your dispelling up by now. I'll take the money, nothing else. You should feel privileged. The crossing is not a place of mortal business. You were the first to come this far. Thank you. That essence of the Fellfire Bloom is meant for the crossing, yes? To cure this region of the Narker curse. I will not allow it. Florian, in all his wisdom, does not see what I see that the crossing is a solution to this long winter. No Fey Empire has ever risen so. It is not the way of things. I have been using the power of the crossing to gradually tip the balance of magic in favor of the summer Fey in Ulcerant. But this had unfortunate side effects. The crossing is tied to the magical essence of this land, and so are the Fey of this region. My tampering has driven them to madness. It is a necessary corruption. Better for a few of us to be mad than to wait for this long winter to end. Perish. I cannot help you. Are you well? Oh, okay.
I, I just leave, I take it. Okay. Bit weird, but fair. Also, it's funny that that their mountain trolls, or prismere trolls, they can give me more hassle than the actual boss of this area. Oh well. Like the trolls, big, bulky, and hits hard. <laughs> the other dude, small, fragile. Might have hit hard, but didn't get a chance to see. I see. Alsir's devotion to his king and court was more powerful than our friendship. That he would compromise his own kind to end the long winter is deeply unsettling. Perhaps in the end, he'd become Narka himself. You have my thanks. Please, take the crossing has changed. I can feel it. Return to Florian and report. Take caution in these lands. Mortal. Your kind is particularly susceptible to its friend. Okay, so this way. Here we go. Now that we've finished this, well, mostly finished this quest, we'll be able to continue with wars for and stuff after. To which has me thinking, thank goodness. Because <laughs> I'm not going to lie, but the Fae stuff is kind of boring. Just because they're all very much like, ah, oh, yes, we're all high and mighty, and then you do something, and they're all like, ah, oh, we misjudged you, mortal. And I will take our leave. A small number of Naka will, and thanks to you, perhaps also we have waited long. Greetings, for Okay, baggage. <laughs>
Wait, we're not doing Brother Tales books. Is that just going to remain stuck on screen? No, it's not. Okay, good. Take the hammer. Oh, it took a... Well, glad I waited so long to go in here. Had me thinking it was like a full dungeon, but nope. No, it is not. It's not a dungeon on the slightest. It's literally just a room. I didn't actually mean to travel into here, but yeah, cool. Arena, Gambling Den, Champions Manor. Guess I can chat to some of you. Hey there. Do you have any? Hmm. Weapons that need maintenance. Well, hello there. You got anything good for me? Oh, here, greater experience booster. Yes, please. Also, take your greater health potions and moves. Take your greater mana. Are you suffering from it? Cheers, lad. Hey there, stranger. You look like you've seen some. Hmm. Do I care for any of this stuff? Honestly, no. No, I don't. Hey, you probably want me to do arena stuff, and I'm really not interested in arena fighting. Okay, that's a lie. I kind of am, but still. I want to do quests right now. Let's see. Run over here, down our cool. Seems simple enough. So basically just follow the path down. There we go. That's those losers dealt with. Ah, nope, nothing there. You know what, fine. I wasn't going to fight you, but you forced my hand. Sure, turn on. They whacked me in the back, so it's like, nope, time for you all to die. That's just how life works.
He only needed one name, the Carver, like the wind or the lightning or the dawn. With his presence, a new age began. The kings of the south stood. They were the lords of the desert sea. Harper's Dursil, or Dursil. But yes, that said, men, tears, tune, or something, so let's have a look. Hmm. Ah, nice. 6% armor is what I'll get for doing this one. Last one, we got 5% armor. Then, where's the Hollow Lands? Oh, it's down there. So we're probably going to go there, there, and then here, but like, oh well. Doesn't matter much to me, if I'm honest. Oh hey, you've got a cool helmet. Greeting. What you surely ask is such a well-heeled Praetorian doing here amongst removing the tarnish for my name and solving. The old Ragnar has died, but he's too clever to openly provoke the Warsmore. I have a plan to settle this, but it requires someone of both delicacy and grit. Hmm. Yes, first we must find some new and better and go into Tearscott or mine, southeast of here, and steal the clan totem from the Cobalt. Tear I don't know where in the mine. Okay, so he wants me to go into a mine and steal things for him. I'll do that another time. Meteor. There we go. Also, we're almost halfway through this level. You know, my current level. Which is kind of nice. I was just gonna meteor them, but like I didn't have any meteor left. <laughs> oh. There we go. Knew something had to be up here. Flint's hunting gloves. That's very nice. And then there we go. It's a good amount of enemies there. I like that. Also, did you see that stuff on Flint's? Like, that was incredible. Like, 10% piercing damage, 10% health. Then, like, if you get the full set, it's damage resist, 10% damage resistance, 10% damage, 10% status effect, and then plus one to might, finesse, and sorcery. Like, what? So that's clearly if you're going down the, you know, all roots path. You know, this one. Wayfarer, Adventure, Prodigy, Polymath. Plus two tall skills? Absolutely mental. I don't get me wrong, I'm kind of tempted to change to that one. But at the same time, I want to stick with sorcery because that's what we've been using. 
I don't like it's working very well. You know, the thing is, I'm just a guy and I mess walking things with a sword. These places never seem the most welcoming, do they? I wonder though, is there train in here? No. Okay. Fair. Fair, fair. Yes? Now who's this? A fresh face is a welcome thing. It's right beside me. All right now. I will end up doing all of those. The heights of menace here are thick with jokes. Some days I dream that I'll do it myself. Why, that's Haldebeer's blade. It's famous from the Fey War. Now it just hangs on the wall, taunting me, reminding me of in battle. Oh, it's a wondrous tale of how Haldebeer slew his foe. I'd tell, but repair the sword? Not likely. There's one man living who can, and he'd rather eat nettles and stare at- You can find the hermit smith yourself, up in the Minotaur Heights. But don't ex- Mind you, but if you think you can just- Just alter fate. I'm quartermaster here. Yes, that's why I came over to talk with you. Darn it. <laughs> Tell me what you need. I was hoping for a backpack to increase my inventory, but you don't have that. I can accept all of these at once, right? Yeah, I can. Nice. Polished armor means you haven't used it yet. I mean, like, your dude's not wrong. Polished armor does mean you haven't used it yet. Have we here? You have the remains of the hammer. It is. I should have expected this. It was forged in the hall of the First Sworn. It must, I think, be reforged there. The hall is not far, only... I don't know what to do when we get there. The hall lies south through the canyons. Meet me there. Yes, I... Time is short. The hall of the First Sworn is south. Meet me there when you are ready. Sounds good. Where is it? Oh, it's up there. No, no it is not. My quest is moved to that for some weird reason. <laughs> oh, it's just on there. Sure, I'll go to that. Speak your mind. Speak my mind. Um, no, thank you. I'm good. Come on, stop running away, Gwyn. <laughs> also, I'm a much better sprinter than you are. Like, look at this here. 
I left a good bit after you and almost caught up. Okay. So, have to go all the way over there. Okay. We see few enough strangers. Yeah, you see a few, barely any strangers, because, well, you're out in the middle of nowhere. That's why. Bugger, you're above my... <laughs> First, he made the river in the arc of the great snake tail. When that grew tedious, he turned his attention to the cliffs, the dunes, the depths. Okay. <laughs> Obviously, we're saving before heading in here. Because that's what I like to do. I'm sorry for the way I left Ironfast. The last time I saw my mother was the day she set off for these ruins. She came here and never returned. I... I thought... maybe... But we must be going. Records speak of a sacred passage. Yes, to reach the ancient forge, you must go through a sacred passage. Of course, I can't be certain. No one but Eamon himself has ever walked those halls. Need on, Oathblade. Putting a lot of pressure on my dude's shoulders, aren't you? But it's okay. We can handle the pressure. I just forced it open. I couldn't be bothered lockpicking. <laughs> so let's head on through here. Oh, hello. Ah, this is better. go. At least that gave us a few more enemies. Uh, we're not going to use it. Uh, hold on, let me just throw that ring out, essentially. Throw it in the junk. No point to me holding on to it if I'm not going to use it. There we go. That's those dudes all dead. 
Let's keep going and try and find that here secret passage that... Well, hello, sir. Burn, baby, burn. There we go. Gorgeous. Oh. I'll take that, like. Now, what's down here? Just some cobble? Cobbled? Cubold, I don't know how you pronounce their names. There we go. Nice. That's all them defeated. So let's move on. Come on, Gwen. This is your mother, after all. All right, let's do this. <laughs> what really is that? It? Oh. <laughs> There's no hope. We've come all this way <laughs> for what? You and I are not Eamon. How can we ever hope to pass through that? Yes, but it can't be done. Try for yourself. Ancient magic bars the way. Only those foreseen may enter here. Fate bars this path, and none may alter fate. You see that, love? You see that? We made it through. Did you open that door? I came to, and it was sealed shut, and... What happened back there? Approach, mortal. Ah, well. Oh Must be remade. The hammer. To the forge. You will know the way. The wisdom is within you. But did you say that? That was just badass me, fate shift in the damn door. It's like, yes, please. Room of the first sworn with Thoru. I just got a skill book, and we're using it right now. So yeah, I put my black my thing up to four. Nice. I might actually work on blacksmithing next. Our stealth. Don't really know. Look at it, how it shines. This is a weapon of legend. Held in Aegon's hands, it fell Niskaru by the score. But now we have our own legends to make. The Niskaru Lord Kamazondu is imprisoned in Cloudcrest Mountain, in the Hollowlands. As Beeson weaves his spell, something called the Niskaru Lord's Crown will emerge. Are you listening? Yeah. 
It is not truly a crown, but emanations of the Niskaru Lord itself, as it emerges from the mountain. It cannot escape all at once, so if we can injure these first projections with the Mystic Hammer, we can close the door Beeson seeks to open. Cloudcrest Mountain looks over the southern Hollowlands, west of here. I will go to Ironfast Keep for reinforcements and meet you there. Yes, it lies south along the Hollowlands. I will be there with reinforcements. Make yourself ready. This will be a trial like to the mountain den and Okay, good. I can't wait that. <laughs> Bloody brutal looking. Cool. Also, seeing as this seems to be like we're going to fight Nascaru, let me change the accessories to that there instead of that. Okay, let's see here. You want me to go over to there, which is... Okay, that's easy enough to get to. Like, I'm not sure how to get up there or up there yet. Best guess is, like, to get to that one, I've got to go that way. And to get to that one, possibly that way. Don't really know. But I'll figure it out another time. I just want to continue with this here War Sworn quest line for now. Even if this one teases me as I run past it. I've also just seen that the way up is literally like right here, so I can actually run up and get up. Screw it, I'm doing that. Mr. Rune Lord, please stop. Oh. I don't really want to fight you. But you're dead now, so. The carver made by the morning. What takes the cycle's centuries to shape? He bored holes in the red marches and chiseled the spine in the Ulceron. Echoes rang through the canyons of Menetir. He gouged the hollow lands and then left it barren. Okay. So yeah, it seems like you just run along here. To get to this next one. Works for me. Ah, nice, there's one up here. Oh, 
Ow. You know what, dudes? And boom. You're out, lad. You are out. How was it during the summer? And in stillness enveloped the darkened land, where one sang, the other danced. And they sang thus. We are Issa, and Om danced. We are Om, and Issa danced. I am the summer's dawn, and Om bowed. I am the morning winter, and Issa bowed. This thing is something, and Om wept. Naught. Of naught, and Issa wept. Let's see here. So where can we get... Oh, who's this? Mate, why are you appearing behind me? This is unfair. There we go. See, you attack me from behind and just still lose. I swipe. Okay, good, good, good. So it seems I can go down this way to get to this other lower stone. Then I can go up the way to get to the other thing. And now there's Abbot here. Okay. Finally, the carver rested. He grew a mountain crowned with clouds by the river and leaned against its side to sleep. Ages passed and the sand settled into his work and all the land was still. That's the hope anyway. We'll also unlock the key of far the kobolds clan told him. So well, well, that way we can easily access it a bit later. Do screw it. There we go. I'll just go steal the clan totem now, I guess. Why not? Why not? There we go, that's both of them wiped out. Now what's in this chest? Nothing good. There we go. By chess, we need, what's that, about 16,000 more XP? That's fine. What's in here? Oh! Glad I opened that. Go HS that.
Yeah, I'll open this one. May as well. Murder the kobold. Just, just over here, apparently. Ow. There we go. Die. Wreck your soul. Gorgeous. Boom. I miss. Love it. There we go. I got that. There we go, that looks like it'll open. Oh well. Inventory space is full. Again. Okay, now we can just leave here, I reckon. Well, once we're clear of the enemies, that is. So what extras are you hiding over here, then? There we go. Okay. Try and get this unlocked and there we go. And it was terrible. <laughs> oh well. Pile of rocks and nothing there. Okay. That's fine. Eh. Oh well, I wouldn't choose it anyway. Like, for what I'm after, it's just not worth it. <laughs> Anyhow, let's get out of here. They really should have built an escape rope or something into this game. <laughs> like the half in Pokemon to quickly get you out of caves. Okay, though. Yes. I don't know how to get up there, which is 
That kind of annoying me. I'll be honest. Oh yeah, that'll be perfect, actually. Mr. Hoover's dorsal. There you are. Ah, you have the totem. Good. We've made some enemies, so now we must make the feeling mutual. Kill three Jotun chieftains known as the Ragnar's Chosen. After killing each of the Chosen, plant one of these kobold daggers in his... They'll be... Remember. Look! It begins! Eh. Not really that interested in continuing that quest right now, so yeah. What's it look like anyway? Cool. But yes, add it to the junk. The wars of Glearathwin came crashing to the ocean's turmoil. Our people, despaired and battle weary, hiding from the ogre's fists, saw Bayala Tyrin atop the revered spire, dressed in priestly garb and circled by a camp of mages. Wise Tyrin called forth the grace of Lyria, her beauteous song paragon of the ethereal the people climbed to her side a summit cloister of spell woven forces she smote the Jotun from the hallowed pinnacle and never again did they return Rathir she named the place where sharp rocks break the water's surface this home for all Dokulfar the lunar crag of Lyria founded in the 14th year after the parting <coughs> Cool. My inventory's too full to even pick up a lockpick. But hey, got some essence of fade there. That's pretty cool. even if I choose, but there is a thing here, so... In ancient times, the desert had no shade. The sun burned the land to ruin. The rivers disappeared, and the animals hid underground. The people cried to Helios for mercy, but he didn't answer their prayers. As the plants withered in the heat, the hollow lands echoed with the crackle of fires. Cool.
but I can run around here to get that slaughter stone. <laughs> Aina, the mediator of earth and sky, came from Ashara. She beheld the suffering desert and swooped down upon the hollow lands. Her feathers shaded the scorching sands. Her wings cooled the broken ground. Her tears fell to the dust where rivers were born. Cool. There we go. has carved his own way into the mountain and that will be our route as well let's go okay yes the crown will emerge at cloudcrest summit let's go there it is 10 to 5 cool great gods Why are you saying great gods for like what's happened just a couple of statues. You're telling me I'm getting six hit one per kill? Okay. Cool. Well, for the Nascari Blood Hunter, well, I did. Oh, nice. Don't care, don't care, don't care. <laughs> oh, what? Definitely take a nose. How's my equipment looking anyway? Ah, it's fine. Just because, like, I thought it was in bad condition, I was going to use repair kits on it, so it was. There we go. Everyone that's here with me. I guess one way to fail your quest. <laughs> Just murder all your allies. Oh, here, hold on, hold on. Are you still two lock picks on a chest to to get it open to find out there was one lock pick inside? How here? GDQ's live streaming mystery funhouse. Cool.
That dude had the right idea, so he did. Because, like, after a big attack, in general, usually people are unable to move, so... He had the right idea of waiting and then going in to attack me after. I'll give him that. Smart dude. We are getting closer, which is nice. I love that, where they're like, haha, we're all safe from this magic, and I'm like, mate, I'm calling down a meteor. I like, just call me Madara Uchi at this point, because you're dead. It really is like planetary devastation. And I love it. We'll hold them back. You go on. Do what you came to do. Oh, here, what's this? Hey, let's go. <laughs> Anyhow, yes, I think I need to have stupid mystic hammer, right? Yeah, you do. Eh, <sighs> kind of sucks, but oh well. Up I go. Ah, so I keep getting knocked back because my magic's hitting the damn thing. <laughs> Nice, I'll have one up there. Let's grab this Nascari stuff and then level up, I reckon. So, yes, we're finished with Sagecraft because, well, we don't need that, if I'm honest. Merchant would be good, lock picking, not very good. Dispelling be helpful. Not ne not needed. Blacksmithing we should get up to max, but I want stealth right now. Let's see here. Yes. And yes, yes. Nice. Ah. There we go.
I have a cow. Now that those are all done, let's head on up here. How here you guys aren't what have you about done, to come? You fool? Do you think this war can be won without me? Yes. Mortals cannot triumph against such malice. Yes, we can. We've fought this war for more than ten years. We could fight a hundred more and for nothing. I could have ended it. I could have promised a thousand years of peace and protection under my rule. That's your problem, mate. Zondu at my side and an Iskaru host at my command. Who could threaten us? No one. Me. Hey. Follow me. I would have freed it, of course. And far long was sure the web of spells would. I could feel it, feel its fire coursing in my veins. We were nearly one voice, one mind. What difference who follows whom? But you, you have severed the bond. It would have given me power. Now Well, it's not letting me hit him, so let me just finish off these other dudes. Let's go, Anra. Your turn. No, it's not even letting me do it. Little one, it seems I won't be stretching my limbs so soon. It is a shame that the mage proved so feeble an instrument of my will. Would that I had a better, stronger one. That is true. What a shame. Imagine what I could do if I had an instrument through which to act as well. Your glory is bright, little one. But I will be here still. But not for long. Be gone. Why can't I just add this to junk? Don't know. Were you talking to someone? I saw it all from over there. You were like one of the first sworn in living flesh. When you're ready, head back to the hall of the first sworn. Don't keep us. Yes, to the hall. Just come, you'll see. Hall of the first sworn. Don't. Cool. Can I like fast travel? Delay. No. Of course I can't. Why ever would I be allowed to fast travel from on top of a mountain? Also, I should be able to not use that stupid weapon anymore, so yeah.
and back out to this door. Then we should be able to fast travel. And that's the main thing. stupid spiders. Enter. Stand before the sworn assembly. You have done great deeds. You have shined brightly as Carewind's blade and cleared the dust from our most glorious past. You have felled foes beyond imagining and stayed true and sworn to war. Therefore, I proudly bestow upon you the high and treasured rank of True Sworn. With one hand, we remain sworn to war in the noble mercenary's creed. With the other, we shall keep watch and strike at every Niskaru threat. Yay, War Sworn quest and completed. Plus one to my abilities, 10% chance to crit hit versus Niskaru, plus 6% stun duration. Cool. Doesn't really help me, but yeah. We did it. You did it. You one of the first sworn stands before me, and I can call him friend. That you can. Okay then. I guess we just move on. <laughs> We're not doing that one, we'll do that one. Drop around to there, Ethan. Then we can just run. Okay, yeah, this area is much bigger than I thought it was, but that's fine. See what does this get it unlocked or Okay, I need the proper key before I can unlock that. Fair. Likely gonna be some kind of side quest to unlock it. But I'll head up this way, sure. There we go. Glad I did. The land flourished under her gentle plumes. As life returned to the burnt expanse, the people crawled from their caves and saw a majestic silhouette against the open sky. They praised Saina and worshipped her likeness. She replied with a call that still echoes on the wind. That says he, not she. But okay. Hmm, that's interesting. Having a path that leads to nowhere. So what's up here then?
Oh, cool. Southwell Conference. Hearts there. Fair. I don't know why we get a random cutscene for these every time. <laughs> Segment. Mm. Doesn't really do anything for me, so yeah, let's just move on. <laughs> oh, here are the spell chests. At least that'll give me some XP, so it will. Both items garbage, but that's fine. Punctuality is not one of your people's strengths, and you have so few. You may recall our mutual friend, Formerous Hughes, the gnome who brought you back to life? I suspect you would. Well, Scholar Hughes has been missing since the attack on his tower. You are, how shall I say, uniquely suited to the task. Don't be obtuse. I am his patron. As such, I suppose that includes the secrets in his laboratories are meant for gnome eyes only. They must I could ask the same question. For all I know, I am willing to assume that simply put, you may be my only chance of locating Hughes. It would seem the incident in Alistar made Scholar Hughes a touch uh, paranoid, but he's running out of play. It's my opinion that there's one hope left to finding Hughes. You, and I am grateful. Scholar Hughes is quite used as an old laboratory in the cavern of Saltwell Mines. I believe he's been conducting. Find him, and you will be rewarded for your contribution to science. Now, he may have. He's quite paranoid. What is it? Nice. <laughs> also, like, it's like, oh yeah, he's in Saltwell Mines, and I'm like, I've already been there. <laughs> So that's pretty sweet. And essentially all I have to do is run back the way. But I don't want to do that just yet. Uh, fine, I'll get ready as...
There's no work here for you, stranger. Check with Motus if you're looking for. Okay. <laughs> Interested in a job? I've got a fey beast situation I need taken care of. Excellent. A pack of wilds. You'll f get to the site and figure out. Good day. Well, I may as well run up here, fill out the gap between here and the tomb. Well, that didn't take long. Let's see now. All right, that's literally just over here. Yep, I can see the lower stone now. Let's go grab that then. Come on, I'm a go. Helios heard the call, and looking down upon the desert, grew irritated. His mighty works were undone, and his brilliance spurned. He called Freyker to his side, and implored the fiery god to strike Syena from the skies. Freykor agreed, but as Syena was too strong, he asked Helios to lend him some of his fire as well. So Helios gave Freykor the flames of the sun. Okay. I watched them day by day. They're foolish men. They know that the land will endure, will heal. I cannot act. I am bound by our beliefs. But an ape... Oh, I cannot make them bloom. Not now. You mortals are not bound as we are. You can grow such things out of season. A friend of the... But first, there are three century plants in this. For each of the three... For now. Hey, Strasser. Come on, you to plant flowers. Like okay, I guess I can try. Oh, I'm in a terrible bind. I don't dare go. Mind you, I wouldn't go up that eastern way. Yes. Well, well, what's a scholar to do against hordes of vicious beasts? Yes, and find out what's wrong. Now that I've found it, well, if you were willing to go to the ca where a cadre of fit lead the way up the slope, we go. There you go, lad. Okay. A bit more annoying, but we can manage it. Hold on, mate. I'm trying to figure out what... Ah, so you're... Great. Okay, there we go. There we go. Oh my, oh my, oh my. Another come to steal the light, come to trouble the rep. They are my friends, drawn here as I drift between the dream world and the world of the waking. The light, source of solace, snuck in, sharp took it northward through the narrow rocks.
It's beginning to make sense. This Fey maiden is real. There is a Fey hollow under this mine. What restoring to her this light she speaks? Most likely return what. Don't think I really actually need to be in here, so I don't really fancy going through it. So her light's over there. Let me try and unlock Shadowthorn here first. Here we go. Oh, actually, that there would be useful. Let's go then. Nice and easy. Are you one of these here sanctuary floors? Yes, you are. Cool. Fancy plant. A fire from the heavens struck Saina, and her plumage burst into flames. She flew high to cool her feathers and dove to extinguish the fires. Still nothing would cease the burning, and she knew that she was doomed. So she absorbed as much of the heat of the sun and the spirit of fire as she could and fell dead to the earth. Now only her bones remain, but she will rise again if life is threatened in the Hollow Lands. Cool. But just let's continue with the main story. Head on in here. There we go. Cool. Oh, ye. There we are. Turn up. Oh, well. Perfect. Don't need any of that, but yeah. Oh, there's that Hughes.
Actually, hold on. Considering I just cleared a space, let me go back and grab these health potions. Alright, let's go try and find shoes, shall we? Wait, that was the emergency supplies key. <laughs> I've already opened that. Oh well. That fact that you can't, you know, grab the stuff without moving other things, despite the fact that you've got room for it. It's kind of annoying. See, it doesn't even count as a space taken up. I just wanted you to destroy something. Uh, let's see what's over here, because apparently there's a hell of a lot of traps. Oh, come on then, guys. Gather round, gather round. That'll do. Hey, idiots, are you stuck or something? Or, like, what's happening? There you go. They're dead now. None of that's any good for me, so let's move on. Oh, I want that now. Okay, so gotta destroy something else here. So we'll destroy that. That way we can pick up those and that. Also, I love how it's emergency supplies and yet they've got legendary armor in there. It's like, what reason? Where are these people just want me to s suffer? Because, like, there you go, another legendary item. So, hold on. I remember 
on my 360 whenever I played as a warrior class, I did actually use the Prismere stuff. Have I been down here so long? Is the madness so great that I see the faces of the damned before me? Or, or is it really you? Oh, it's really me. By the tone. Come closer. Let me look at you. It has been an eternity since... Are you? In many ways, your awakening has brought me nothing but misery. But that is not your fault. I am to blame for all of it. Wait. Do you hear that sound? It could be the sons of Laz, but it could be someone else. Uh oh. Why are there ninjas now? Don't you lock go? <laughs> I use have successfully saved you. The last we spoke, it was the Tuatha that reduced my lab to cinders. Now it's assassins. Everywhere I go, destruction follows. I have grown so weary of it, my friend. All I ever wanted was to unlock death's secrets, to shed light on the shadows. I never wanted this. Thank you. For more than just your protection, for being the one good thing to come of this disaster. I have few friends, but I gladly count you among them. You must be mistaken. I've tried to contact him ever since I fled Alistar, but he never replied. Until now. But Tien, of course. When all the facts are considered, the truth will emerge. Ah, oh, I am a fool. Octien has sent you to search for me. To have us killed together. Those assassins are proof of this. The Well of Souls is his project. Once it was functioning, he no longer needed me. Not if he could salvage the Well in Alistar with Ventrinio's help. Ventrinio de Cellini. We used to work together in this lab on projects sponsored by Templar Octien. But when we were tasked with creating the well, Ventrinio sought to use any means at our disposal, regardless of the implications or consequences. Eventually, he was taken away, and I was sent to work at Alistar. But it seems he continued his work here, long enough to create those monsters. They are the animated dead. Early experiments in the field of immortality. Ventrinio named them after a mythical figure who rose from the dead. He looked on them and saw potential. I see only abominations. No, not me. But Ventrinio's old notes suggest that he may know a way into Alabastra. I wonder, perhaps, is it possible that you have met Ventrinio already? That would explain it. You were attuned to his well, but raised from mine. Unfortunately, the only way to find Ventrinio is to go through Templar Octien, which will not be easy now that we know of his treachery. Never. The only voice he wishes to hear is his own. We cannot deal with Octien within the boundaries of Edessa. Not alone. There is one who has the power to discredit him. Templar Joriel. She is reputed for her wisdom and strength of character. And, as I recall, she and Octien do not exactly see eye to eye on matters of policy. If Joriel can make Octien answer for his crimes, then we will gain access to his information. That includes the location of Ventrinio's lab. If you wish to uncover the mystery of your death, then you will need Ventrinio. He is the key to Alabastra. Find Templar Joriel in Edessa. We don't have much evidence, but I have a feeling she will help us. Oh, don't call it that. 
You're just having a talk with Okchen in the library. In return for your discretion, he'll... I know it's unpleasant, but when you work with the Templars, you just start thinking this way. It helps you stay alive. Okay, so... Where are we going? Over there. Over here. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, the assassin garb is pretty cool. Okay, now, yes. Hmm. I'll go do the sanctuary flowers, because why not? There we go. Seems like you do actually need to strike it with fire first. Which is, you know, fair, but a bit strange. And there we go. It's that done so nigh. I guess there. Like in terms of story, I reckon that'll be us for today. So well, so if you want to stop watching, fair enough. Just know I do appreciate it, and don't forget to follow if you enjoyed at any point, but for the next half hour, or however long I'm on for, I'll just be doing like we side quests and whatnot. Well, that's his quest done. Then find her light over here. Oh yeah, that's right. Ah oh, well, there's no real fast way to her, so... Guess I gotta go down and round. It's not a big deal or anything by any means, but yeah. Hmm. Okay.
Okay, just leg it on up here. <laughs> Grab that. I'm actually kind of glad with all the story progression we made today. <laughs> it was good. Love for you, kidding me right now. Another come to steal the light. Wait, so who am I giving this to? Okay, apparently I'm going into Shadow Thorn. I guess. Wasn't the plan to run in here or anything, but yeah. Oh, so that just gave me thirty feet. Like that's insane. I love it. Absolutely mental. Let's just wipe them out again. I'll grab those. I love the fact that I don't even have that much junk now. <laughs> like, the game's really just like... Me at please stop picking up so much stuff. Anything up here? Nope. Just head in through the door then. The spell chest, so let's get up. Oh, don't like this one. Oh well. No big deal. I don't eat this thing anyway. That actually got me curious. How many of these things have I dispelled? Um, 90. And you need to do 50, so you do. Wait, what? Dispel the door? Okay. <laughs> Now I have the light, the rev... 
Damn good for that that item. I'm also fine with that. that. My clock picking is literally the easiest thing in the game, so it is. And to spelling, well, I just saw with to spell 90, so we don't really need to do anything with it anymore. Oh, nice. Now I can just head on over here. Good question, actually. Good question. Take it, I just go in here and hand it in. But, ah, there you are. Relic. Was that it? Chico, no matter. Facts are, without you, I'd still be tugging my beard at the bottom of that slope. So, please, have this. Goodbye. Thank you for all you've done. You look well armed. Aren't you here about the Crudduck? We have a vicious one on our hands. Confound it. Between the Canyon Hill incident and that beast, our schedule's ground to a halt. You got... We put a price on its hide, but who'd be... Well, Edgar's lived in... You look like you can take care of yourself. Oh, it's you. Well, let's go speak to Edgar. There's no work here for you, stranger. Ch Capstan sent you my way, did he? Yes, I'm familiar with old Bloodbane. The surest way to draw it out of hiding is to attack those... Good luck. No one's been able to... Yeah. Well, let's go kill these brownies then. Blood being you seem to be extremely strong. Please die. There we go. I take it I just return and hand it in. Good advice, I guess. Good advice. Hello. I've been hoping you'd come by. My mother would no sight or sound of Bloodbane since you ventured out into the desert. Yeah, I caught up. They can start work on the dune head site, and that you've earned your pet. You look like you can take care of yourself. Don't you worry, mate. I'm great. Oh, what do you want now? 
goodness you're here. It's my miners. They've gone dead. The lunatics fled out into the desert. I tried to stop. This is the work of that fae. The one who sits atop. Gulliver watches the mine from his perch on the hill to the south. You'll find him. Him? I tried to stop. I bit my beard. Nothing is going right. Nothing. Well, let's go speak to Calivar then. See what's up. Greetings, Martel. What are you here for, Martel? I'll not suffer another child of dust. I've had enough of your lot. Especially though what of us are query. Your miner's plight is not my doing. If you look to rectify their situation, then we share a foe. The mortal that calls itself Edgar Aaron is to blame. Curing the miners of their affliction, take the relic from him and find your miners. He has fled. You would do well to bring it back. Farewell. This dude's literally just went and betrayed his own miners. What a cunt. Well, let's go. Didn't realize this side quest would be so long, but yeah. I'm not complaining. Although I do only have like 10 minutes. Yeah. Okay, it's quite short, so. Shouldn't be too bad. You found me, stranger. Been speaking to Calavar, have you? What can I do for you this time? You've spoken to the Fey, I presume. I thought I saw you scaling that cliff, but I never meant to take it this far. If he just packed up his damn operation, nobody would have been harmed. I... Perhaps there is merit in cooperation yes. with you. You kill Crodoc and Spelunk Fey Hollows for a living, but if Motus doesn't leave the Hollowlands, I'm finished. Kill this pe- <laughs> I was just trying to make a living here. Success should have been mine. I started my operation long before Motus ever arrived. My workers have abandoned me, and I haven't made a single coin from this place. This was all I could do to reclaim what once belonged to me. You understand, don't you? Fine. It's your... I'm sure the Odessan Praetorians won't be far behind me now that the word's out. I won't be... I could have killed him, but I decided to be nice. Okay, now where the heck are these dudes? Oh. They're not actually too far away from each other, which is quite nice. So hopefully I should be able to get this done before I've got to go. Come on, run faster, dude. There we go. One saved. Four left. Come on. We can do this. Reginald. That's two. Really? Get stuck on nothing? <laughs> Ah, 
Arrow, go. Really? Araco. And Araco. Now you come on, dude. Come on. Never noticed how close we uh... Araco, now one dude left. Let's go. This dude's all the way out here, like, my goodness. Also, I love that I saw the yellow thing on his head before I saw him. <laughs> I swear there was a lake here a moment ago. What? What happened? Have a go. Well, it looks like everyone's back. Edgar's facilities are vacant now. They're yours if you want them. They were never particularly pr A few of the miners feel so indebted to you. They'd like to work there for you, if you'll have them. You should visit the mine with Good day. Are you telling me I just got a mine for doing that? It's more dangerous. Oh, I gotta return this relic. Okay. Let's go then. This is a lot of running dudes. I will get up here. Greetings, I shall relieve you of the relic. For a mortal, you are remarkable. But as you mortals say, the dust for now then. Nice. So did I literally just get a mine? Is that what's happened? The Motors Miners have told me all about you. I'm Vince. I'll continue to run the mining office for you, if you'll allow it. And if it doesn't suit your tastes, with some spare coin, I can arrange for renovations. If you have enough gold, I can clean this place up and furnish it with goods from the... I'll get right... Let's upgrade it as much as we can. Oh yes. We're building a new stash. Please All of that stuff. And yeah. Here, mate, I would like. Edgar had been causing all this trouble in the air. With a bit more gold, we can improve the facilities even more. Time to get to. Put it on, that pushes me into it every time, but yeah. How goes the splugging? I've kept things for, for a tad bit more gold, I can add on it. It'll be ready in no. Nice. Here we go, that's the house fully upgraded. Hi, this dude over here can hopefully upgrade the mine. Greeting. Hail friend. For a small sum, I'll renovate this mine. If you give me the gold, I can start clearing out one of the I'll start cleaning out the Nice. Let's get the mine fully upgraded before actually doing anything inside of there. I can't believe that. There's no excuse for it. Mo for another bit of gold, I can clear out the neck. We'll have this place. 
Lovely job, bloke. These lands are hey, boss. Do you need me? Just a little more gold, and we can open this. Will okay, now let's actually have a look around this mine. Wow. No inventory space left, of course. There's a bear trap right there. Why is there a bear trap in my mind? You know what? No idea. Also, how big is this darn mine? Okay, so yeah, it's quite big. Do you know what I'll do though, actually? Destroy that, I don't care. That way we can grab these lockpicks that are lying around. They're more important to me. I could rather have lockpicks than a lot of this other stuff. Okay, now right, let's look in the rest of the mine before I gotta go here. It's a bear trap disarmed at least. run round, grab these last couple of chests. Honestly, I did not expect this mine to grow so large. <laughs> but yeah, it's absolutely massive. But hey, we're on to the last chest now, you not? Which is nice. Not bad. And there we go.
Ah, it's just a straight run out here. Cool. Straight we run out here. So thank goodness for that. Thank goodness indeed. And truly a marvel of modern architecture. Sorry, boss. We haven't yet sold off what we've produced. Check back. Take care, my friend. It's no worries, mate. It's no worries. But just before next time, I should probably clear out bunch of these side quests here just to get it done don't even know what that is down there but yes anyhow thank you all for watching i hope you enjoyed and i'll yeah catch you on the next part later